My name is Ian McEntee and this is my sociology video blog. Uh, well, for this assignment we had to watch two films. Uh, both obviously um, having to do with drug, drug use and sport. The first film looked at the recreational side of drug use and sport. And then the other film obviously looked at the performer enhancing drug use and sport. Um, when I'm going to talk about my personal favourite of the two films, which was Unguarded. Uh, Unguarded was about a American basketballer named Chris Heron. Um, he was basically just a, a freaking idiot, a really talented kid. Like, and um, he, he struggled with, with recreational drugs from, I think, when he started playing in college. He was he a was very, very good high school player. And it's basically about his um, how he his addiction and the trouble he went through and the fact that he uh, an awful lot a lot of the time he didn't get any help for um, his addiction and um, I thought it was a very um, kind of gritty look behind the scenes you you really get to feel that you, you get to know um, what type of man Chris Heron was and um, I think that's in complete contrast to the second film we watched which was Marion Jones Press Pause and uh, Marion Jones was an Olympic athlete who uh, she won five Olympic medals I think three gold two bronze and um, Basically, she was stripped over medals for ta taking PEDs, performance enhancing drugs, and I think this that video is it's very I think I find it very biased, as it doesn't really show what sort of impact the her taking PEDs had on her competitors, or it didn't really even go to why she took she decided to take performance enhancing drugs because. I, did, I actually personally don't think she needed to take a personal hands of drugs because uh, she was she seemed like an extremely ta uh, talented athlete. Um, so looking at the questions here, what did I expect from the film? Well, from Unguarded, I, I didn't really know what to expect with, with Unguarded. It just um, it starts off with Chris Heron. He's talking in front of uh, high school about his life experiences and he obviously he's obviously taken as a, a positive thing that he's, he goes out and he just tells a story a very moving story about uh, how even top athletes can suffer from drug addiction uh, what to expect from the Marion Jones film I think the fact that she obviously had to give permission for it to be published they put a kind of a positive spin on the whole thing, so uh, I wasn't uh, I wasn't too gone in the Marion Jones film. Uh, what have I learned about drug use in sport? Well, basically that even the the best athletes are capable of taking form of drugs. Marion Jones might might have any have needed to take form of drugs. She was. She was still extremely talented even without them, and she she decided to take them. So obviously, I, I it would kind of make you skeptical about the top athletes today whether they're clean, like so. And um, has my opinion changed on drug use in sport? It it I think it has more so from watching Unguarded as it shows that a player who was on the front page of magazines and and is extremely talented could have such a a, tr a trouble behind the scenes that he um, had such a struggle with uh, drug addiction uh, that is my video blog